The Minnesota Fighting Vikings went hard in the paint this offseason, adding edge rusher help. They re-signed Steven Weatherly, they drafted Patrick Jones and Darius Robinson, but some fans think that they still need to bring in further rushmen to bring the rushmen back to full strength. One idea that's been floated around is trading for Eagles defensive end Derek Barnett. Saw a bunch of it in the comments, some of it on the socials as well. And now, I'm usually the, hey, trade for everyone, sign everyone, draft everyone guy, but in this one, I'm sort of sort of meh on it. Let's get into why. First, let's trace the genesis because people are talking about it and it goes back to a June 17th Bleach Report article. One trade each NFL team should offer before training camp. Vikings offer 2022 third round pick for Eagles defensive end Derek Barnett. Mike Zimmer's defense got a little bit of an overhaul this offseason after a down year, perhaps most notably adding veteran quarterback Patrick Peterson. But Peterson and company can't hold up in coverage forever, so looking for ways to add the pass rush is always a good idea. Being yet another team to reach out to Philadelphia in an effort to poach likely outgoing players could work towards his goal. Think 2017 first-round pick Derek Barnett, who has yet to live up to expectations and can now be considered expendable with free agent Ryan Kerrigan joining the team. Barnett is a gamble, but not one that's too costly. At worst, he bolsters the rotation. At best, Zimmer's defensive acumen helps him start realizing some more of his potential. So background on Barnett. Like they mentioned, number 14 overall selection in 2017 out of Tennessee. Uh, he has two ties to Vikings history. One, he was drafted with one of the draft picks the Vikings sent to the Eagles in the Sam Bradford trade in 2016. Number two, he strips that Case Keenum in the NFC Championship, which effectively ended the game. Because the Vikings were down 14-7, but in the Eagles red zone, trying to make a comeback, not so much. Barnett does have 19.5 career sacks, career 10.49% pressure rate. Last season logged a 62.6 PFF pass rush grade. The Eagles picked up his fifth year option and he's earning 10.051 million this season. Now the Vikings do have around 14 million cap space this year, but do they really want to punt it all on Derek Barnett? Now, so that's why I'm pretty meh on the deal. Number one, the proposed trade cost. The third round pick is a big deal. Now, if it was a fifth, Sure, I could get on board with that. Number two, the money cost. If the Vikings have to take on his full salary, why? Why? Now, if the Eagles want to split the difference and pick up, I don't know, six million of it, and the Vikings can get him for four million for a fifth or sixth round pick, yes, then I will be in. But as of right now, a third and ten? No, absolutely not. All this for a guy who I think is capped at a ceiling. I think that Barnett will be a career, you know, solid third edge rusher, but a pretty marginal number two. So I'd much rather have DJ Wanham and Patrick Jones and Janaris Robinson getting that work, all of them on the rookie deals. So again, I'm the trade for everyone guy, but with Derek Barnett, I just don't think that the juice is going to be worth the squeeze. So I'm sort of whatever on it. But your thoughts, should the Vikings trade for Derek Barnett? Let us know in the comment section below. Subscribe for daily Vikings takes. Want to support that work? Pull something in Venmo, but until next time, Skull, production value.